Ladies and gentlemen, it has finally happened. The man, the myth, the legend in their story and has posted a video. This has been a year long wait. I don't even remember what he sounds like. That's how long it's been. But today we're going to be reacting to that zone between area 50 and 52, which I'm guessing is area 51. I love this meme actually. It's quite funny and I can't believe people actually showed up to it. Some of you might not even, some of you that are watching now probably haven't even watched the other reactions of an internet historian because it's been that long. <laughs> okay, let's get straight into it. And away we go. I mean, it's good. Oh, the following statement. Okay. Um, I. Aliens. Yeah, I agree. They exist. <laughs> and what's oh. more, they're here and they've been walking among, among us, us for millions of years. Among us. Just look What's up it? at the night sky. Each one of Has those. He got a new mic. He sounds different. Alien. Shoot at I don't remember what he sounds And like. the police show up. Coincidence? Break into the CIA. Just looking for clues. They put you on. He sounds younger. Forest. Coincidence? There are no coincidences, only truth bombs, and the government is holding the fuse. Locked up tight in Area 51. Oh no. And so our story begins with one man. Oh. Joseph Experience. <laughs> On June 21st okay. of the solar year 2019, Joe spoke to a whistleblower, right. Bob Lazard. Now, Bob claims to have worked at the Area 51. Okay. And so, Joe summoned him to Joe his Rogan. sensory deprivation satellite, where he could yeah. ask him probing questions about the that government facility. The machine that was able to read the, the size of your dicks. And yeah. Oh, what? You for yourself this incredible I'm sorry? testimony before the UN dun, takes dun, it dun. down. You used to work at Area 51. When did things get weird? Well, the way this went down was I only got hands on with one of them, and I was f***ing an alien. It produced a little discharge from the bottom. It was exciting. Um, <laughs> we turned the lights um, on and all these guys are there. So what in the out of context is this? We have, <laughs> you know, actual hardware from another civilization. It's a big, um, <laughs> what is happening right now? <laughs> Live in a house. That's bull I like just swinging around on trees. Absolutely. We are the sex organs of the machine world. But for people who don't know, let's give them the bullet points. How right. tall are you? I'm 5'10". You don't seem to have any muscle. You almost know, like a frame. Is there anything wow. else you'd like to say? Well, the disc, the flying saucer that I worked on. I saw it sitting there and I thought, oh my God. Hey, Bob, it's probably a good idea if you shut up. Oh. Wow. I worked underground with the aliens. They shot my hand off. The, they're underground. There's bases. They're shooting lasers through the Earth's crust and they move them at light speed. You, you big. <laughs> what? I'm not even doing anything. Drop dead. Hey, why don't you come on out to the Nevada Whoa. desert? Deal. The f out. All right. That's it, folks. Oh. Good night. Hey. These revelations were sent out all over the globe using beams. Absolutely. Beams. And it started an incredible awakening. Inseminating the people's brains with knowledge. Who killed JFK? Flooring them with the revelation of it all. Oh, the the McDonald's. With a spear. And soon they were. Did I say the truth nuggets? <laughs> truth and soon they were bursting with righteous curiosity. Bigfoot is a human animal hybrid. hybrid, hybrid. All right, here's the Google searches Damn. for Area 51. That. Big spike there, that's when Joe Rogan put out his podcast. Ooh, you get the idea. Wow. And it's just all Joe Rogan's fault. It reached the right man at just the right time. Oh no. A 21 year old named Matthew Roberts. Not Matthew Roberts, Facebook user. He oh no. He was in Area 51 before. And he believed. He wanted to see him. Real bad. But what could he do? He's How the could starter he of all this. Get into Area 51. To check him out. Think, even, think, think. Even though it's Joe Rogan's fault, this is guy's fault too. One. If I ran into Area 51, I would be shot and killed. Yes. Scenario two: If me and all of my friends ran in, we'd both be killed. But yes. Scenario three: 
if there were so many of us, thousands, so much fodder that they eventually ran out of bullets, then someone surely is going to get through and touch the government One person. in a special area. <laughs> My God. Within minutes, he was drafting a Facebook post. They can't stop all of us. I'm willing to die for the government, let's do this. On September 20th, 2019, we'll all meet up at the Area 51 Alien Central Tourist Attraction and coordinate our entry. If we Naruto <laughs> run, we can move faster <laughs> than their bullets. I remember see this post. Oh my god. This event then goes into the ether. Mm -hmm. And from here, it was up to the Facebook algorithm gods to decide what would happen next. And it will blow up. There's a lot here to be excited about. I think this could be very positive <laughs> for our society and economy. People you, from Meta. all across the flat world were receiving the invite. And they yep. began pressing the attending button. Yep. Wasn't it like millions at the end of the day? Like how many shows to do it or wanting to go do it? Oh my god. This is the slowest RSVP I've ever seen. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought you already clicked it. Never mind. Within just a couple of days, the event had picked up hundreds of thousands of attendees. Jeez. People loved the idea so much, they began making memes about how they were going to raid the base. So many I can really show you a fraction of them, rapid firing mm. them out like the bullets that would soon be gunning them down. It was the biggest meme. And so the event spread, and spread around the internet, eventually morphing into... Everyone who is something is gonna raid Area 51. Young people from Here's all over the globe are joining up to fight for the future. Nigel, a runner. No pointer, runner. Stevens, agent. Silent, a runner. Freeman, 713. I am a sentinel. Everyone's doing their part. <laughs> are you? We have the ships. We have the weapons. Captain, the put his gun down! Oh my god. We need soldiers. We need you all. And just like that, <laughs> the game was on. <laughs> And oh my god. Oh, and is the I new love campaign? The You're gonna love it. To be or Nord to be. Plans or disappear. Nord to be. Dreams take over. I live. I laugh. I Nord. Beautiful. Nord on every device like a blank canvas. I can be here and anywhere. Mm. Jam a man of his <laughs> excuse me. Will you break these chains? Wherever I go, there you are. NordVPN.com slash internet historian. Beautiful. No, thanks. Look, I just... Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's just an idea. I know what you want. You want the female audience, and I know women. Good morrow to you, ladies. Have you heard about NordVPN? You should get access to the international Netflix catalog. Never miss another episode oh of The God. Handsome Man Show. Oh, don't you hate it when your dishwasher gets region locked? No more. Oh, I feel so safe what? in NordVPN's big, strong arms. Especially with their new product, Threat Protection. It protects me from malicious sites and downloads and trackers and intrusive ads. So Why is there so many cats? NordVPN.com slash Internet Historian. Because the V in VPN stands for the jump. <laughs> All right, I'll do the ads you like. Get oh, I love it. Use some threat protect. Take your online safety more seriously. Uh, oh. Have you heard about their amazing prices? VPN.com <laughs> slash internet story. <laughs> Tell them who sent you. Ad over. Nice. Who is Area 51? Welcome Good question. Brief. Let's do a bit of background on Area 51. Secret military base, first developed in 1955. This is what it looks like on Google Maps. It's approximately this big. Total area size, 51. And the volume, oh. a big mystery. Until 1997, the government refused to even acknowledge that it existed. That is, oh. until they were forced to by lawsuit. That lawsuit was about the death of two men who were former employees. And Wait, how did what? they die? 
That's a good question. Well, How did they die? Not aliens, but rather experiments. Toxic fumes from burning garbage. Oh. Yeah. So what they would do is burn a whole bunch of cool high-tech refuse on the lot, let the uh -huh. deadly smoke blow downwind, and the staff was stuck breathing it in. A few oh. years later, bing bing bong, cancer. Other than that, the public hasn't really wow. been told anything. So all yeah. people can do is speculate as to what the hell is going on in there. I think that they are keeping remnants of a UFO there. We don't know if it's aliens. We don't know if it's time travel. We don't know if there's minions in there. Uh, virtual reality that seems so incredibly sexy. But what has been leaked is that they do test flights on new alien craft. Motherfucker, don't you tease me? Come on. Produce new alien tech. Breed the latest version of the newest gayest frog. Do not get confused with Roswell. That's over here. Area 51's over here. What and the is final Roswell? thing that we know is that security is top notch. They oh, have that locked down. Cops on bikes, let's go. So, you want to break in anyway. Okay, yep. but it's going to require some research. And the first thing to find out, has anyone ever tried breaking in before? Probably. Yes, We've several never heard times. Of it. In fact, in January of 2019, oh, an unnamed man broke through security barriers and drove eight miles into the base. He got okay. out of his car with a metal cylinder in his hands, and the military opened fire. He was shot dead oh. at the scene. Wow. And there was this time when a film crew from the BBC was arrested for trying to get in. This is BBC News. This wow. time, when a vacationing family of four went off track. You get the idea. They're not messing around. Put your fucking hands up. I'm not going to tell you again. But there's one okay. story to take them all. And Will disguises identity, but he is my personal hero. Oh. The month is November. The location, Las Vegas. And the protagonist, a professional limo driver. Now, he's oh. more than a little unhinged. He decides oh. to start harassing oh, no. and sending death threats to a lawyer, whom we think was going to represent his defense for this incident. If you've ever seen this TikTok, oh my that's our boy gosh. doing donuts and driving backwards down the Las Vegas Strip. Anyway, Yo. fast forward three weeks. You think it's Tokyo like Drift Real Life? And this guy is already doing donuts at a car park near the airport. My man. Then he decides to drive from the car park into the <laughs> airport itself. Offense? He thinks it's Tokyo Drift. No Drift. problem. He drives right through it and onto the <laughs> runway. He's just driving <laughs> around, whizzing between planes, almost crashing several times before wow. eventually parking on a ramp. At this Jesus point, he Christ. jumps out, puts on a clown mask, and storms right up to a private jet. I'm sorry? He announces aggressively to the flight staff that there is a bomb in his limo. Quote, I have a fucking bomb. I'm going to blow this place up. His plan wow. to commandeer this private jet and take it to Area 51. However, as sound as this plan was, it could be the quick response sky, by police surely? meant that it wasn't really working out. Uh, so he bails back to his limo, tries oh. to make an escape, until eventually police catch up with him. Oh, At that no. point, he is quickly arrested. They take him in okay. for questioning, and he starts yep. telling them, "That's right, I did it to see the aliens." He also told them to refer to him as the Chosen One. Oh, And, no. by the way, I have high security clearance. Also, I'm involved with the mob. And someone owes me millions of dollars. Later on, the bomb defusal crew checks out the limo and determines that it's just a wanna say to fire the extinguisher with a bunch of wires and duct tape and some fairy lights. Wow. Now, at some point, he gets out presumably on bail, and CNN reporters walk up to him and start asking him questions. No, no statements from me, he says, but you should talk to my lawyer. And then he proceeds to hand them the business card of the lawyer that he's been sending death threats to for the wow. last three weeks. Amazing. After all that, wow. the judge ordered that he be sent to a mental hospital for assessment. Or so they say. Ooh, how convenient. <laughs> oh, okay, no. so people have really died trying to do this. That means we're going to have to be a little more covert. So over at Area 51 HQ, the military can see that Facebook numbers have reached 1 million. Yep. And it doesn't take a genius to calculate that even if just 1% of them show up, that's 
wait a minute. Run those numbers. <laughs> this many people. In a crowd that yep. big, there's bound to be at least a few who do something stupid. Yeah. Fact, the military took it so serial that they even went over the nuances of Naruto running. No, they it's didn't. A real slide, no, by the way. no, it's not. And it required Don't a real lie. demonstration. No, no now, shot. Now some undercover operative no then took a photo of no that brief way. and they uploaded it to Reddit. <laughs> That's they intend to use our amazing. Us. Right. Oh my god. So if the military decides to do this, <laughs> things will go pretty badly for Matthew. So Matthew yeah. goes back to his mind palace. Think, think, think. Uh, let's not keep saying it's a raid. Instead, let's do a music festival. This would give Matthew an alibi okay. and throw authorities off the scent. I'm willing to music festival for the government. Let's do this. All right, Reddit. Here it is. Alien Stock 2019. The official EDM <laughs> party hosted by Matthew Roberts. Set to take place in Rachel, Nevada, a town that just so happens to neighbor Area 51. Uh, it has 50 th total residents. Just 50. And practically no infrastructure. Oh, Perfect. Yeah, my nice God. try, fellas, said the military. And the captains and the generals all started planning their own EDM party with the what? deep state. Three groups in particular. Introducing Group E, the E local state police. Police have their work cut out for them because, owing to this party, they think there could be upwards of 50,000 people descending upon the little town of Rachel. Be Lincoln County bad. commissioners trying to tackle the tough task of preparing for a potential inundation of people. And Sheriff Kerry Lee has less than 30 deputies. The county declares a state of emergency, <laughs> oh, no. and they allocate an extra $250,000 worth of enforcement for the weekend of the raid, as well as an extra 300 police officers I don't officers think that many people showed up. That many people are going to stress the community to the point that it, it oh, just, no. it, we can't cope with it. This is some of the most exciting stuff that I've ever gotten to work on, and uh, I'm- Hold on, I'm, Mark. Group D, the defense. And I'm going to take up my gun and shoot somebody. So the FBI agents that oh, showed Jesus. up, showed up at 10 a.m. They contacted my mom and they're like, so she texted me, she's like, the FBI's here, answer your phone. So I was kind of scared at this point, but. This report from the Nevada Department of Public Safety was released last year and it features some very interesting details. For example, For example? they called a group of YouTubers <laughs> trying to plant a tracker on the bus that goes to and from the base. We're going to pull okay. an epic prank. Highly illegal. <laughs> and you may not Thank be you, that surprised to hear that the military isn't actually that worried about people breaking into the base. Turns out they have automated weapons. Not so automated what? weapons. Automated? automated. Like robots? Like drones? No, instead, they think there's potential that real terrorists will, you know, do a thing or a thing. So, counterterrorism was given a budget to sweep for chemical, biological, radiological, and explosive material. Although, nothing was found. And there's just one okay. last group getting involved. Uh, media. As well. The mm, corporate press. Yeah. Disinformation agents in the mainstream media were getting involved. Lies, they immediately yeah. started warning people not to raid. Use of lethal force authorized. Spouting contempt for the stormers. What started as a joke Facebook event quickly turned into a phenomenon. Reaching well, it began as a joke, but now it's turning into much more serious. Astroturfing <laughs> campaigns by late night ha ha men number one through seven. It's much more likely they'll see them tasers. Ha ha ha! Laugh it all up. It's just a big joke. Who say they're interested just keeps growing faster than their bullets let's see them aliens and they weren't afraid to give some of the biggest brainest <laughs> takes you've ever heard oh, it's not no. clear the 1.1 million facebook followers who said they are going to storm area 51 are real and not russian bots you're a goddamn genius <laughs> we'll make you take us serious let oh, the train my begin. god that's that's a base take right there. You've got a train? Speaking of that, I think it's time for my workout. And so the Raiders began training. <laughs> we train. Wait, no. 51. So let's go. Sandwich. Oh. They began pushing their bodies. They're all weeps. Go on, make it happen. 
pushing their will, pushing their spirits. Pushing their friends and family's patience. Oh my god. Oh my Who wants to call me to kick some alien butt? In September, join me. We out. And that's what fitness will be like in the metaverse. Nice. I'm gonna need a plan. As we zero in on the day of the raid. The count is up to 2 million attendees, and that puts us on par with Jesus. the world's largest standing army. That's crazy. So to coordinate all of these troops, we'll need a battle strategy. Lay it on us. From r slash memes, intel yeah, was being filtered down to the troops. Groups such as the Minecraft YouTubers, <laughs> the Normans, <laughs> the Weeds, Facebook <laughs> Moms, <laughs> the Pile, <laughs> Chaz, oh. the Crack Kids, it's a free crack giveaway. Florida Man, the Australians, the gay Reddit mods. Okay, this thread is locked. And the North Korean defectors. They all have their role to play. What? So, Godzilla <laughs> comes in from the east while the Australians yeah. make a distraction that allows oh the minion cosplayers God. to breach from the south. Of course, these very serious strategies would have to be disguised as memes so that they could be spread across YouTube, Reddit, and TikTok without the threat of being... Bang. Although, <laughs> not everyone was as tech-savvy. Mm -hmm. Authorities managed to nab one of the main cartographers, and they pressured him into an interview on the television. Um, it took me a total of five minutes to put this image together. It was sort of like a, a battle strategy, almost. It was completely rooted in satire. That was just completely rooted in satire. And no one should raid, this is just completely a joke. And completely just a joke. Mission counting sheeple complete. You can take him out. Jesus Christ. Okay, so remember how we're not raiding anymore and it's just mm. a music festival? Wink, 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 wink. Well, yep. bad news. Okay, so it sounds like you maybe are looking at changing venues. Possibly. Possibly. <laughs> it's all up in the air. We're putting Maddie on the spot here. There's a lot of challenges, so. <laughs> but it's two weeks away, so. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of got to, like, uh, figure it out, I guess, somewhat soon, right? Yeah, it's all kind of falling apart. Wow, See, I didn't know Matthew that. had organized alien stock with a few other people. But his main business partner was Connie West. I didn't plan it. Mm -hmm. It planned me. But Matthew okay. is the headliner. His name is attached to everything. And he's starting to get worried about a fire festival type situation in the oh. desert. Be a fire fest 2.0. He wanted to make sure there's plenty of water, yeah. food, security, Stop. insurance, Geico. et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And yeah, here, that's true. deals and communication start to break down. Eventually, there's a lawsuit and it's kind of boring. Things that they were supposed to pay for, I'm stuck paying for. Who cares? We're going to skip it. But the TLDR is that they had a disagreement and Connie said, I don't have to prove to you what I spent. You didn't sign a fucking contract with me to begin with. So guess what? Wow. I don't need to prove to you a motherfucking thing. And Matthew said, Wow. Matthew then took $70,000 worth of sponsorship money and declared Alien Stock and Rachel cancelled. But then, okay. at the same time, Bud Light walks in. It's the Bud Knight. We're saved. They say, hey, why not do it here? In the Vegas. It has plenty oh. of lighting, indoor plumbing. It has everything. Ew. Matthew said yes. And then using the website for Alien Stock, he told everyone to not go to Rachel and instead to go to Vegas. Welcome to Alien Stock Las Vegas. Sponsored by Bud, Bud Light. Light. Oh, also wow. a porn hub, but it's a long story. Connie I'm sorry, was what? Left to pick up the pieces. However, she would not be discouraged so easily. She decided to press on. It's going to be a great party. No matter what, it's going to be a great party. She had to take I didn't full insert the cricket. Oh, it's going to be a great party. I didn't set the crick noises, they were just real crickets. No wow. It's going to be a great party. She had to take full control of the event in Rachel, life dipping into her you. savings and even mortgaging her home. I'm working out of my own pocket. I think this is a liability. I'm out. So, is it clear what's going on? Wow. It's yep. worth doing a very fast recap because there's an event in Rachel that's been declared yep. cancelled, but also not cancelled. Also, alien I forgot stock, to mention there's an stock. event in Hiko that isn't cancelled, but it will be on the second day. There's also that third festival in Las Vegas, which has the former promoter of the first one, and they both yeah. share the same damn name. And none of this has anything to do with the actual raid on Area 51, which is here, which has mm -hmm. several gated entrances, by the way, and none of them have been declared the official gathering point. Oh, Confused? Wow. Yeah, pretty yeah. much everyone was. It's a goddamn mess. 
people, rightfully, put the whole thing in the too hard basket and instead of going to one in the middle of nowhere, just went to the one in Vegas. That's fair. Let's fast forward to the weekend of the raid. Oh, For better God. or worse, Rachel is about to open its doors to the millennials. Hell yeah! Don't let the I don't think a lot of people aliens. showed up to this one, right? Do you believe in aliens? I don't. I don't. Run! Get out of here! Oh, you know, I want to hear about the alien liberal agenda. They could have some good talking points. We don't know. To protect my mind from interference. We have a wanderer. Don't let me leave, Mer! It could be anything stuck. But it's alien stuff. How do you see walking with that shirt up over your head like that? I know. And the first ones are supposed to be always, you know, the best ones. Paranormal lawyer. PhD level field investigator. So right. in downtown Las Vegas, did they change the name or is it still alien stock? I think I'm on my highest high I've ever been in my life. Look at it. And, and we are taking a look kind of the area here. You've done a, a lot of work in a very short period of time. The security's here, the medical's here, the food is here, the people are here. Are they? Most importantly. Where are they? I don't see no one. Toilets are here. <laughs> that was pretty good. I, uh, I, just, I just went through a breakup, guys. Well, it wasn't quite the event that they had hoped for. Yikes. But they did do a commendable job of acting retarded for the news. This is the most <laughs> <laughs> I, I do oh, yeah, for no. scientific reasons. Oh, this is like no. the most millennial thing that's ever happened. Jesus but don't Christ. Forget, Hiko. Or Taiko. No one knows how to pronounce it. This is being hosted by Jesus. George Harris of the Alien Research Center. The owner of the center is Las Vegas businessman George Harris, creator of Alien Tequila. If you want to have fun, if you want to have a great look, it's a great day. Base camp was equipped oh. with a vendor village of 10 okay. food trucks. So where did this one come and from again? Three-time Grammy Award winner Paul Oakenfold. For some reason. I was told there's a lot of people coming. Uh, well, right now things are kind of slow at the Heiko event here, so that's kind of a disappointment. Now, Heiko Base Camp was expecting <laughs> somewhere between 1,000 and 20,000 attendees. It's okay. quite a range. Maybe. 50 people here. Oh, Clapping some alien man, cheeks. Yeah, but no cheeks are clapped yeah, at the all. Cheeks. Where's, Where's the, the cheeks? cheeks? This is like the first of a big thing. Uh, but it wasn't. In fact, it seems as though the majority of the attendees was media. The press. Uh, that her parents is actually alien. So, after the first night, they decided to cut their losses and cancel the whole event. You know, the I producers can't. of the show, it's very, very, very expensive. And Wonder why I didn't hear about this one. Sense. Because basically all of the attendees were stolen by. Alien Stock 2019! Let's go, baby! We were gonna go out to uh, Rachel, and then we decided that we didn't want to get stuck in the desert. Uh, as much as I like Mad Max, I don't want to live it. The Las Vegas <laughs> Alien Stock, sponsored by Bud Light, was a smash hit. They've got carnival rides, photo ops, video Yo, games, and even a pool. No running. Who could have predicted this? You make a post at 2 a.m. with on a page that has 62 likes. That's and actually now you dope. Have I didn't know about this. Of people that are ready to come out to your show. That guy's it's, an alien. It's, it's absolutely amazing. Back at military HQ. Okay, so this is what I actually heard. It was like five people up. outside. They're adding more guards, upping the security and enforcing a no-fly zone across the county. They were even infiltrating raider groups. You could be standing next to an officer and not even know it. There's a like big a... undercover presence here. And they were giving stern warnings from the PR team. They posted this tweet. The last thing millennials will see if they attempt to raid Area 51 today. Sorry to disappoint you, Wow. <laughs> you triggered my trap card! Millennials immediately seized upon the tweet, doing what they do best uh, by pretending to be offended, successfully yeah. having the tweet taken down wow. and forcing a public apology. I'm yeah, that's... All right, this video that's is getting uh... very long. Let's hurry up to the main event. Okay. The raid. Let's go. Hey, are you coming? Yeah. Following is an accurate representation. Recreation of the events, okay. Could be like one guy in the middle of a field or a desert. Is that Hogwarts? That Nuru, Nuru music? 
Let's go. <laughs> oh my god. You could go no sir. He's made an anime. <laughs> <laughs> this is better than the actual thing. Well done. <gasps> There's a trader. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh no. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Oh my god, this is intense. Oh. Can't keep getting away with it. Mines. <laughs> Segways. <laughs> Hoverboards or whatever they're called. Jesus Christ. Drones. Smoking these meats. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> Zuckerberg again. Damn, that speed. <laughs> This is incredible. This is what should have happened. A war crime. Damn. Damn. What an ending. Oh, it's not over. Sadness and sorrow. That was good. That was bloody good. Huh? Oh no. They're not dead. For 1%. What's happening? Monster energy drink. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> is that Wii Sports or Wii Shop? What is it? <laughs> it's from the Wii. <laughs> Alien room. <laughs> it's all true. Oh my god! Is it Paul? Paul, what thank is... you for saving us. 
We are so grateful and horny. I'm sorry, and what? Yes, we wish to be your big titty goth alien GFs. And you won't be a virgin what Reddit browser. What is happening? <laughs> It wasn't quite like that. It was pretty close to something like that. I don't Although, know I guess you could was. say that only a small group showed up to the main gates themselves. Yeah. A million people. Of over two million people, in total only about 200 actually went. But it's not about the quantity, it's the quality that counts. Nice outfit. Thank you. Now over! <laughs> people mostly behaved themselves. I mean, I think it's awesome you guys are, you guys are following the laws following directions so yeah. but they weren't about to leave without a consolation prize wasn't there like a grandma that went over the line <laughs> get some of the area 51 soil top secret rock top secret rock <laughs> you can have it it's from area 51 Thank you. okay also present at the raid were a few youtubers so oh. i came here to get myself an alien as a pet we're here to rescue the aliens it's like, it's like halloween wow like, just... got... annoying people are, are you guys gamers? Play games? No? You, you watch anime? Yeah, so you got the rebellious <laughs> youth, and then you got people trying to lure E.T. into a cage with Reese's Pieces and stuff. That's a pretty good summary of the crowd that you have out here this weekend. But respect to the wow. true heroes. Security. For keeping everyone. Ah, I'm just kidding. It's the guys who got underneath this fence. God Career. bless them. And this cameraman, whose foot raided the base. <laughs> and this random woman, who yeah. decides to just That's the one. start walking. <laughs> the base, right there. No they one's literally stopping her. don't care because oh they know she won't reach make. it. No. She's going home. <laughs> she gets charged for trespassing and receives a $1,000 yeah. $1, fine. She doesn't uh, make it to the end, even so far it away. Time the to wrap storm up. is over. Because everyone's moms were there to pick them up. And if they were late again, there would be big trouble. Okay, good oh, night, everyone. Damn. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to sleep now. A <laughs> <laughs> oh. meme that turned real. The end. Beautiful. Psych. Psych. It's not over. Oh. There's one more thing that I want to tell you about today. Oh no, what's happening? Because storming Area 51 would go on to inspire a plethora of other events. The storming oh. of Loch Ness. That thing can't hide from I all didn't, of us. I didn't know about you that. We've seen it. What did it look like? It looks like a big stone. Over 27,000 <laughs> said they were going. Actual number six. Okay, That's why I didn't hear about storm it. Storm the Bermuda Triangle, why not? Oh, it yeah. can't drown all what? of us. And potentially wow, millions actually went, but the, you know, the evidence would be lost, oh. so how would you know? I am uh, under the water, <laughs> please help me. Or how about Storm the Vatican? They can't molest us all. Oh, Interesting twist on that one though. My Someone cancelled the event. God. But That's overall, everyone crazy. had a pretty good time. Not good, not that fun. Isn't that what Area 51 was really built for? Mm, no. Like something like that, you know what I mean? No. I mean, like... no. <laughs> Beautiful. That was the best. Well worth the year of waiting. That was beautiful, especially the Area 51 battle. Lamal, remember when I said that we were going to do shorter videos? Yeah. So more frequently? Yeah. Looks like you fell for it. Ah, wow. Ha, ha, ha. Ha 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 ha. See you in the next one in two years. Oh my god. Or check please. out the Incognito Mode channel. That has a lot more upload. Oh, I didn't. Goodbye. Oh, okay. Try to check that out. I didn't see no other channel. Okay, pretty good. That was crazy and insane. I loved it. It was brilliant. It was brilliant. Let's be honest. Okay, everyone, that is the end of the video. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you check out the original in the description down below. Enjoyed that video? Maybe you enjoy other reactions? Suggested you by YouTube right there. Click it. It will take you to another one. You might like it. Also, everyone, check out the most recent video or the second most recent video. That'll be the one up there. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. That'll be like down here-ish, I think. Probably. We'll see. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed yourself. I'll see you in the next one. Laters.